Hey everybody, I'm Captain Floofers. And I'm Sorlin Greg. And welcome back to uh, Link to the Past Triforce Hunt. Yes. Um, now, I, I do assure you we will be beating this tonight. Uh, when, if you remember, Absolutely. we were getting kind of stuck, but um, we kind of spoil, you, spoiled ourselves. Did you do some math? Well, oh yeah, that's right, you did. Yeah, we, we kind of spoiled ourselves. What um, did we spoil? Now, uh, ba basically, Greg got curious when we were done filming last week, and he looked at the spoiler sheet um, because mainly he wanted to know if we could, if we had to go out of our way to either kill Aganim right. or clear out the pendant dungeon. I wanted to check and see if it was an Aga seed, and it is. And it is. It in is. in fact, the. Um, the most efficient route, according to that, that into, according to the uh, the spoiler sheet, is that um, we collect nineteen of the twenty required Triforce That's pieces, right. I remember and now then we, go and then yes. go and fight Aghanim. Um But that, uh, um, but that, that basically we had our way into misery mire and stuff. But yes, that wasn't why we were spoiled. We already knew that that um, that uh, Triforce yes. piece was in misery mire. What, what where we got spoiled uh, was when uh, Greg noticed there may have been a discrepancy in my in my total. Eagle Eye viewers may have noticed that we indeed missed something in our something important in our initial survey of the overworld. Basically, Greg went, was going through the list and he's got he, and he's like, "You got the two in Hype Cave, right? You did go to <laughs> Hype Cave. It's Hype Cave. You can't miss." Cave. And at first I was like, of course I did. That's the first place I usually go when I go That's to the, the Dark first, World. Yeah, as soon as you have Dark World access, you go to Hype Cave, because it's like six items. It's yeah. Great. Uh, well, well, guess what? Uh, <laughs> we went and we went and checked, just for grins. <laughs> guess what, chicken butt? Um, uh. if, if you look to your right over here, you will see Hype Cave is not open. <laughs> if your game you wish to save, go, you must back to Hype Cave. <laughs> so, oh, um... That's uh, we're gonna get two two Triforce pieces in here. Yeah, spoiler alert. There's two <laughs> Triforce pieces in here. Do you have it? No, you have a heart. We just ripped his heart out of his chest. Yeah, it's an artificial heart. It, it beats, but I can't feel a thing. It's okay as long as he's not near microwaves. Uh, he's there fine. There's one. Uno. Another bottle. bottle. Okay. That's ten it. arrows. Ten arrows. Most important of all. And another. And boom. Okay, so. I gotta go ahead and save and quit. Yes. Because we can't leave the dark world without the. Why can't I go down? There we go. There we go. Now it's working. So now we have one piece left. And in order to do that, we have to go kill Aghanim, go get the Quake Medallion, and open up Misery Mire. Yes. And actually, um, if I remember correctly, that is not a spoiler because we did find out through a telepathy tile yes. that there is one in Misery Mire. I, I mentioned so, that earlier. Yes. I mentioned that earlier. But yes, okay. in order to... That's right. In order to make any more progress, we need the Quake Medallion. And in order to get the Quake Medallion, we have to kill uh, Mr. Aghanim. And hey, hey no that. thing. We can just... Now, some may notice that this actually... We are now officially using an outdated version of the Link to the Past randomizer. Oh, yeah, you mentioned that. Yes, there have been some changes made to the Link to the Past randomizer. I highly recommend, incidentally... If you are like me and well, if you're like me and you're a writer and you want any excuse to not actually write, you love podcasts. There is actually a podcast that is put on by several Link to the Past randomizer speedrunners called Go Mode uh, that is excellent. And their most recent episode is actually all about the update to the Link to the Past. Uh, so you should listen to that for the all the gory details and new modes and shit. But the the big difference is Triforce Hunt no longer ends right when you pick up that 20th Triforce piece. There is actually an NPC in the courtyard uh, of Hyrule Castle who looks exactly like Sahasrala, uh, who you speak to once you have all 20 pieces. I assume the reason for that is, you know, if you want to, if you, if the last piece is in Paradox Cave and you want to see what, what the hell else was in Paradox Cave, oh, what could this be? I'm just kidding. <laughs> Both the chests in this dungeon are keys. Yes. There are no um, other. There things. are never any progression items in Agadim's Tower. And good thing we have the lamp. Mm. We do. If we didn't, we'd be in trouble. Come I cannot on, tell you how many times I have gone to fight Agadim, gotten to that first dark room, and been like, ah, 
I remember that was like the main thing you were dreading was going was coming here uh, on your seed because you're like we're like oh yeah we can just go and kill Aghanim and get get that Triforce piece in the tree oh wait we don't have the lamp <laughs> I think I did that on the seed didn't I yeah you said that I, I started it oh no I didn't but I I Damn knew it. that because many times I have been like oh let me just go kill Aghanim because there's a progression item you know in the tree if the if you know if the hammer is in the tree I'm like cool. You know, it's not that bad. I know where the hammer is. I just have to kill Aghanim for it. But then you don't have the lamp. <laughs> yeah. It's like, shit. Okay, well, the lamp has to be somewhere that you don't need the hammer to access. So I want to play it, and then you go and this the is this is in your head. And, and this, this is where the logic math comes in. Yes. This is where the math happens. And that's that, that's fine. Um, you know, that's that's part of the fun, I guess, is, is figuring out what, where, where you can possibly go next. I mean, yes. When I do Link's Awakening, I just have, like, a tracker, and I'm like, well, where can I go, and, like, where have I not, um, ticked off, I guess, or checked off, rather. Ticked off is what they say in Britain. Ah, it oh, was, yes. I ticked it off on me, on me, Mobile. Uh, on me mobile, <laughs> but then a chav nicked it. The chav, he looked just like Tom Yorkie did. <laughs> How witty and perceptive. <laughs> <laughs> and now we must fight with knives. Guys, if you haven't seen, if you have never watched the classic Space Ghost Coast to Coast, um, it's wonderful. Knife and Around and is a great Knife and Around is the one with, with Tom York and Bjork. I and it's wonderful. Oh, you should check the telepathy. What's the telepathy tile? I mean, we don't Heart need Heart containers it. in plain sight. I don't see it. I like the one where um, where he had Joel, Joel Hodgson on there. And um, he, like, just brought up a, a crappy movie clip and tried to get him to... to to, to riff on it with him, and he's like, you know, I, I really don't do this, like, at the top of my head like this. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. Um, I think every single time I'm in that, this particular room, and I have it, I just have used Bombos. Oh, I didn't really think to. Once I get that in a run, I tend to just use it to clear rooms, because oh, yeah, there's lots that. of magic in the... The thing I always, because I always, I, I'm I'm always worried about getting stuck um, by something that is, is far too difficult. That is actually one of the new options that is in uh, the Link to the Past randomizer. There is a um, a setting. It is it norm. The no, new normal setting is called Advanced <coughs> Item Routing, which is it's just randomized but behind logic. There's a new setting called Basic. That essentially ensures that <coughs> you, Sorry. if you need to go to a Dark World dungeon like the Ice Palace or Misery Mire early, that you will are able to find before having to go into it enough heart containers and or bottles and or the mail to protect you in those dungeons. Okay. So that's an interesting change. Uh, one of the anyway, I'll shut up now because this is Floofers is run. One of the more interesting options I've seen, I probably I, I do want to try it at some point, is uh, swapping the light world and the dark world around. The inverted, yes, that sounds like it would be a hoot. Just that would sound like it would be a hoot without randomization, but it would probably need it to work properly. Yeah. But uh, yeah, we're almost done here. We are almost there. Oh no no no! He's gonna lightning you. Oh. He always lightnings you when he goes to the center square. I forgot. Square. It's been a while since I've, I've fought Aghanim. It's okay. He did like one heart worth of damage to you. You have the red. Oh, I have the red, have the, uh, red the red mail. The red mail. <laughs> he's like this this dude. He's not. This is not how I thought this fight would go, Ganon. <laughs> uh, excuse me, Ganon. <laughs> I was assured that, that the hero would be easily defeated. I was also told he was an elfin boy in a tunic, not a gigantic robot. <laughs> All right, and now right, we so are we in the dark one. world, and we have to we have to save and quit to get back out. Yes, because we never found the mirror. Nor will we, but that's okay. Oh yeah, I'm like, don't you need the mirror to get to Misery Mire? No, you don't. No, you need the mirror to get to Swamp Palace. So uh, what's the closest? I think sanctuary. sanctuary is closest. So now that we have killed Aghanim, there is a state change in the overworld. A few things have changed. There are some more difficult enemies running around. But the big thing is that once Aghanim is dead, the two lumberjacks who are cutting that tree disappear. Um, presumably they were put in a gulag. Um, I'm they not ju sure. they, they're just done for the day. Yeah, that's fair. They, they are off drinking. Um, 
So you can now attack their tree with your fancy boots. Like and, like we did in the uh, in the regular LP, but yes. I guess for those of you who didn't see that, or no. Uh, and get that item. I can't get that heart. It's stuck in the in the wall. Oh god! Oh god, beast! Oh god, you oh, no. engaged it! It's turned into Hydlide! <laughs> okay. <laughs> More bees! There's the tree. I know, I'm just... Oh, I'm you're escaping. I'm escaping the bee. Yeah, they're not in there. They... I don't care. The bee's gone. All right. So then we can dash into the tree. What happened to Gary Cooper? He, uh, died. <laughs> and um, then we can go and get that quake medallion over... over is it, there's... Oh, there's fairies there's over here. fairies, too. I could probably stand to fill up this last bottle with a fairy. Why not? Yeah, why not? Club fairy! And if we go this way, then we get that item we saw Quake earlier. Medallion. And now we can go out of here, play the uh, play the duck ducktail song, and um, head. Woo! It has the same beat as Mambo Number no. Five when you think about it. A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> no. A little bit of Scrooge McDuck in my life. A little bit of launch pad by my side. I haven't seen the um, the uh, the new DuckTales show, but I heard it's very good. The new, oh, new DuckTales? Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, David Tennant. David Tennant is, is oh! <laughs> Scrooge McDuck. David Tennant man. is Scrooge McDuck! Well, they can't have Alan Young do it. He passed away last year. Was it, or was it the year before? It was, it was within the past few years. But he, he lived... He's Doctor Who. Doctor Who is Scrooge McDuck. <laughs> he was Doctor Who. All kinds of always be Doctor Who. All kinds of V-Sync. <laughs> oh, yeah. That, there's some issues there. I don't know if that's going to show up on the thing. Do you have the hookshot? Uh, no. Okay, you can bonk across. Ah, okay. You just got a... Bonk. There you go. I was about to say, like, how is it? How is the the most optimum path taking me in here without the hook shot? <laughs> okay. I know how this story goes. What story? That I was joking about oh. having to kill all the the wizards. Oh yeah. I believe there's one more down at the bottom. Ah. I'm not even paying attention to shit. I'm just, just. Oh yeah, I know it's squiggly. There we go. You know, I, I am. I, I I did a run earlier this week. I've actually stopped doing runs because I'm playing The Witcher Three. I'm I'm in Velen. I'm gonna do it this time. I'm gonna beat the game. I'm not playing on Death March because I got torn apart by wild dogs three times in one play in in the same playthrough. Um, but I did, I did have to go in here and clear it out completely on a run, and I'm feeling a little bit more confident about Misery Mire. It's still not my favorite dungeon. Well, it's a not fun dungeon it, to begin with. It's like the Ice Palace. Um, I just feel like the Ice Palace is a bit more... Other than that shitty puzzle, the Ice Palace is a bit more straightforward. Well, my, my head is, like, cut off the side there, but... That's a, <laughs> well, just scooch over. Um, the interesting thing about Misery Mire is there are several sections of it that you may not no, need why. to access. Um, that's why you frequently get the thing about such and such as fire locked in Misery Mire. Yeah, that's that's the one it was, was fire locked. Oh, it did say it was fire locked? It did say it was fire locked, Okay, well, yes. we have fire, so that's good. So well, we're going to have to go with the route that gives you the big key normally. Okay. Um, and then you light the fires. I don't remember what that is. You you light the fires and dig all the ditches and burn all the witches. Uh, and then you get the Triforce piece. Can you bomb this? I don't believe so. You can try it. They shouldn't put they shouldn't put cracks there if you can't bomb them. You they shouldn't. That's no no new. That cracks. is false advertising, Nintendo. I want to say it's the because it's randomized. I want to say it's the thing all the way on the right. The door, you gotta go down in where the things are and go like to the the top right. Oh yeah, you've got a fairy. Yeah, yeah just die. I've got a fairy. I've got a just red lotion. I got a blue potion. You. 
but the future refused to change. In a good way. There you go. The future uh, refused to change. It refused. The future is, I win. <laughs> yeah, it's either this one or the one that you... Oh, that one's got a key. So you've got to find... This way. Find some chests. I, I, I heard you say... I believe there's, there's a key... I heard key. you say go right, so I'm I just going kind of going right. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Get, go up. I believe the top left skull might have a key under it. Yes. Yes, and if you pull that skull that's in the, in the, the shit, in the spikes... There's Bhutan. And you could use the cape. Or, yeah, now you're going to have to, to suck down a potion. Whoops. Why did I push the X? Wrong, Bhutan! That generates a chest, so... That might be something. The mirror! The mirror, okay. The magic mirror. Alright, so go up, I guess? I guess so. Because I don't, I don't... I know the initial goal here is to... Hit the hit the switch to transform the the blue pegs down and the, the other pegs up. Oh, the crystal switch. Yeah. Okay. Hit the crystal switch, and this is the crystal switch. Yeah. So it's it's at the end of this, and there should be a chest down. Oh, here I remember too. I remember this room because it looks like a fish bones. Yes. So smack him, and there should be a key under there. Yep. Yep. Now you can go down that path because it's open. So beautiful, beautiful. We're doing well here. Uh, maybe bust that open? I'm not sure. Oh, hello, Dr. Light. Dr. Not-So-Light. <laughs> Put on a few pounds. Step into this castle, the capsule so I can kick your ass. <laughs> yeah, now this is up. You can go follow this back down to the main lobby, and then you can get the key that's under the skull that's between the two, the two ones that were blue before. Right, okay. That's that's this way. Yes, and I believe once you get that, you're going to want to open that door that you just passed. Okay. Pretty sure that's the way to the... Um, to the fire lock. To the fire lock side of Misery Mire. Oh, maybe that's the... That's a oh, key. Oh, that's a key. Good. Okay. I thought that just had a key <laughs> under it. I forgot that it... it say, false alarm. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, oh shit, if that's the compass, we're fucked. Um... Oh, and there, of course, is another one of those. Okay, do I have to... Uh, we like, don't have a thing. Okay, push this block. Will that do something? No. No. I think we got to go, go... Go down? Go down. Damn it. Diggity down. A bombos and a bomb slug. Let's check. Fun. I'm going to check for keys, because I'm pretty sure you need to go through that key door. Pretty sure. I don't... Like I said, I did this earlier this week. I don't completely recall which way is which here. I apologize. Damn it! Mmm! The game just wants to draw it out now. It does. It just wants to fuck with you. Like a bad little pony. I don't know where that came from. Okay, um... Which way have we not been? There's another room... If you want to go down... Oh, we can go to the one. Yeah, that's right. Uh, go the up one. here. Go up here. Yeah, go down the stairs. Oh, you down can the stairs. go down that path that was blocked by the uh, the piglets on the first level. Ah, okay. You can go that way now. Check that. Check that. Check oh. that skull. Does that have a key under it? Fuck! No, it has Fucking racka fracka. Rootinous tootinous. Yeah, we're, I'm, I'm trying to clear this so we can start the next LP. <laughs> it's the wildest ride in the wilderness. And this, this seed does not want to light up. It does not. This is the... Oh, no. Go back. No, I don't know if it if it is or not. I know that's... One of these leads to the big key. Normally. Yeah. Oh, can you go... You can go over there now, I think, because the the thing is down. Shit. Yeah, go... go I have to go around. Yeah, go around. Okay. You're going to have to run when you get in this room. Oh, I have to go across the Because normally you have to... I don't know if you're going to make it. Yeah, you're not going to make it. Normally you have to hook shot across. Oh, that's, that's crap. How can I do that, though, without the hook shot? Did you might just have to have to book it with the, the Pegasus boots as much as possible. If I don't eat all my potions first. Just... 
down, scoot across, and scoot back. Yeah, 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 go, 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 go. There we go. There we go. Okay, that's the big key. That's fine. This should be down now, and you can get that that chest. That's yes, a key. Okay. okay, don't open that door. Don't open that door. We go back around to where go we were. Go back around to where we were, yeah. Okay, woo! Woo-hoo! A woo-hoo! Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Okay, oh, whatever. Oh, man, you didn't. I thought you didn't take damage there for a second. It just it didn't trigger, like, the flash. Is this the one? Or is it the one, the one, the one down, down here? here? Yeah, okay, go on ahead and go across. Yeah. Pardon moi. Good, 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 good. This uh, what's is... All this then? I think you need to... Do I have to light? I think you need to light all of them uh, to unlock the one up top. Oh. Go down, though, real quick. Can I get what's down there? Hopefully magic, because I don't have any. Oh, fudge. Because up here... Oh, there okay, we go. Yeah. Up, up... Actually, don't, don't, don't do that. I don't Go up the stairs? Go up the stairs, because this is where the four... Yes! This, this is, is where, where you've got to get be. all four of those. Oh, this. Yeah, you've got to get that, okay. and then get those. I think those. there's some whiz i got to kill, too, just and to get them it, out of the it's way. it's going to scroll them back. Now, I don't know, because that's fire-locked, and the other thing is also fire-locked. Let's try the other thing first. Go back downstairs. Shit. Cause I, have I, a wanna, I, I want. I have a feeling it's this, though. I really let's 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 save state it. All right, hang on. File. Let, let's save state it. Saving state. Eh, your mouse is really sensitive. Save state. Okay. All right. So yeah, go ahead and do this. If this is it, then cool. If not, we'll reload the state. Shit. And you just All fucked right. it. You just fucked up the puzzle, man. You fucked the puzzle. You stuck. Your penis in the puzzle. Maybe you should just do the other one then. I mean, it's okay. Oh, it resets. It's re My a, bad. it resets. B, we could reload the state. I thought you had to go back. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, so you gotta push all of them. I'd rather not have these guys here attacking me while I do this. And I know that. Well, I know as soon as I get out of the room, they're gonna respawn because that's how these fucking things work. Let's so just push the. Push black. Get which one? A, the bottoms, and then push the middle one for each out of the way. Is what I would do. Push the bottom and the top in, and then push the middle like down or up or whatever, and then do that with both of them, and then do that with the ones up top, and just light all of them. I would probably, frankly, just because you've just got to get them all at the same time. You can probably do it with the lamp. There's probably enough time to get all four of them with the lamp. I mean, they're not any faster than the usual ones, so... Yeah, and... Unless you really get and, fucked by the whiz robes. And the fire rod just shoots forward, so it's gonna, like, hit... Hit yeah. blocks. Do, do. And this should cause the room to move. There we go. That's gonna move the thing in the next room, and you're gonna fall through the hole. Water go down the hole. Fizzy water goes down my hole, and hopefully... This is gonna be... The end. The Triforce piece. Come on. The Twilight Zone is Come what I'm about to say. Hurry up. Come on. <laughs> right in yep, there, yep, right? Yep. yep, yep. Uh, is there... I don't think there's anything up there. Okay, so here we go. Or is it you? Yes. That's it! Boom! All right. Do you prefer bacon, pork, or ham? Hmm. I like all of those. I was things. about to say I like all of them. I had but I, uh, I, I bacon's the best one. I probably eat ham most often. I had a ham sandwich for lunch actually. Oh, nice. Um, the Kentucky. I don't know if you guys have ever had the Kentucky Legend. Nope. Uh, let's like Never thick heard of it. sliced ham. They have it at Food Lion and oh, okay. other retailers. I've, I've been to Food Lion a while. It's really good. Yay! Fellowship of the it. Ring. I still don't have fast forward set up. Oh, that's okay. Who cares? So this was uh, this was, this was run my run of Triforce Hunt. And Mega Man X saved the world Mega Man by not killing Ganon. Exactly. Um, so yeah, that's that's it for this. Uh, that was pretty fun until I got stuck. Um, and then Salubrious is Homecoming. What the hell is that? Is that supposed to be Sahasrala? Oh, you know what I think it is. 
vultures really Oh, it's together. because it's the Japanese version, and it probably has a different name in Japan. Oh, okay. Did you know that uh, in Japan, uh, A Link to the Past is called Triforce of the Gods? No, that's awesome. Yeah, they they changed it over here I because they didn't, want why. God, they didn't want gods in the title. I understand why they did that. And A Link Between Worlds is the Triforce of the Gods too. Huh. Because they wanted to make it that they make that link. Triforce of even more gods. Your uncle makes blocks. Uh, I don't think we really need to see my stats, do we? I, if you want to see them, uh, love for sale. It was because of oh, heart. it was a heart. Yes, love for sale. You want to find out what was on the pedestal at least? Did we ever look at what was on the pedestal? Yeah, it was it was ether. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh yes. All right. So this seed did get increasingly desperate. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and, okay, and that's cool. Cut this here. So we're not gonna do that. But uh, next up, we're. Do you want to tell them? Uh, yeah, next up, uh, we're going to be doing um, the slightly requested uh, Let's Play of a Link, uh, Link's Awakening yeah. on the Switch. Um, Destitute Boy has lunch again. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> so, um, look forward to that. Uh, we're just going to set it up here in a few minutes. Pretty play, much, but yeah. You'll have to we'll wait until tomorrow started. to see it at the very least. So, uh, until then, I've been Captain Floofers. And I'm Soylent Greg. And we'll be here next time. Join us, won't you?